A mother is dead and her four-year-old child is in the hospital following a shooting early this morning. Now, police say they are looking for the mother's ex-boyfriend. This happened just after four this morning on Barker Cypress Road and South Park View Road in West Houston. Channel 2's Kathy Hernandez joins us live from the scene with the very latest. Kathy? Good morning. A very tragic story. You can see police are still here investigating. They're now looking for the woman's ex-boyfriend as a person of interest. They say the couple had a history of domestic violence and had just broken up a month ago. And I heard a, a three-shot burst. Of pop, pop, pop. And I thought maybe, well, somebody was shooting a firecracker. This neighbor heard three more gunshots from an apartment on Barker Cypress in South Park View at about four this morning. He then saw a man running away. Kind of tall, skinny, ran out, jumped the fence, and ran on the other side. This neighbor who wants to conceal his identity says he recognized the man as the woman's ex-boyfriend. He used to live there with her. And he was always beating on her. Right now, we'd like to speak with the ex-boyfriend. Um, there is a history of domestic violence, my understanding here. Investigators say the shooter kicked in the front door. The suspect made it upstairs, kicked in a bedroom door, and then some, we have about some witnesses say about six gunshots heard. The woman was shot dead. Her four-year-old daughter, who was sleeping with her, was hit with shrapnel and is expected to be okay. Investigators say four other children were inside the apartment and were not hurt. It's sad. I wish the police would have done something in the past. I mean, she didn't deserve it. She was very sweet. Nice person. She doesn't bother anybody. That neighbor also talked to the victim recently who said she was done with her ex-boyfriend. Police have not yet released the names of those involved. The other children are now with relatives. Reporting live in West Houston, Kathy Hernandez, KPRC, Channel 2 News.